So I'm gonna walk you guys through real quick on all the little things you need to do so you can take care of some uh, Indian runner ducks. So we know that a lot of people have just been asking questions about them. They're one of the flightless ducks, which makes them really cool. And what I like is as you'll look, as they're looking up at me, they'll turn their heads sideways so they can see my face. I think they actually can tell the difference between you and other people. And they'll come right up to me, which is really cool, and see if I have anything for them. They'll come up and they're super friendly and they're, they're just the neatest ducks. They're nothing like the chickens. Uh, this yellow guy is a drake, and then the other two ladies are, are gonna be our egg layers. We're only gonna do three. We may do some more in the future, but a lot of people ask some questions about like what we do to raise them. But here, you can see I've cut up uh, just any kind of green, so uh, kale, Swiss chard, whatever you have, just cut it up, they're gonna love it. And then if you cut it up for them small enough, they will just eat it all up and they'll be uh, growing really quickly. These guys have doubled in size in, in less than a week. Now, if you look over here, I've taken a milk, uh, excuse me, an egg crate and then used uh, six, or excuse me, nine portions to be their, their food. And I've also put in some chick grit in here and this is an organic uh, starter for them, food for them. We've got a heat lamp that puts off quite a bit of heat. So they're, I checked it with a thermometer, they can get to about 80 degrees right here, which is plenty warm for them. And then uh, we're using a paint tray. And I got this idea from somebody else, but I really like it. They're able to go down into the paint tray and splash around and come back up. Uh, obviously it's pretty messy, but you have to clean it. I, I usually do it once a day. I'll give them new water once a day and I put about a half a gallon of water in there and that lasts them for pretty much a full day. And so they just finished eating some greens, which they really enjoy. They love the greens. You gotta have greens in your in with your babies when you're doing them because that's something they really need. But these guys are just so fun. They just, they get, they're so hyperactive. They, they definitely just run around like crazy, but they are so cute. But yeah, I really recommend it. Indian, I recommend Indian runner ducks if you guys ever get a chance. Uh, it's something that you'll you'll really appreciate. They lay they lay eggs a little bit better than other ducks, and they also are flightless, so they're not going to take off, which is really cool. But man, are they fun! So anyway, that's a little little bit of help, and this is just a Rubbermaid tote, the biggest one they had at your average box store and then i filled it with um some shavings that i made myself i just uh used my chainsaw on the right alongside the the grain just cut cut with the grain and makes tons of chips and uh just uh just a little update on these guys and i'll i'll try to get you guys another opportunity to check them out in the future all right